So what is a meta description? So a meta description is the piece of text that is underneath your title tag. If you see here underneath in our uh, Google search, we've got our title tags, which are 60 characters long, descriptive and contain SEO keywords. And underneath we have um, our meta description. It, they're slightly longer. There are 160 characters and they're also SEO rich and descriptive. So it gives you the opportunity to flesh out the content that is on your web page. So I'm going to show you how we can add this to static pages uh, in our web website. So we go over here to our pages um, panel. Click uh, over on the side here. You can see that our page has got a little anchor. And we're going to click that, go down into our settings and scroll down until we get to SEO settings. And under in the SEO settings, we've got our title tag and our meta description. And inside our meta description, we can add our title tag. So I'm just going to save that. So this is and show you how we can do it on uh, our collection pages or dynamic pages. So it's the same thing. We come down here. So we've got our static pages here and our collection pages here. We click our icon. And then we scroll down and you can see here that we've got our SEO settings, our title tag and description. So I can post in our title tag here and you can see that it comes up in our search preview. Now, the issue with this here is that if we put in this description here, it'll be the exact same throughout all of our um, dynamic pages. So what we actually want to do is we want to go over here to this little purple add feel icon and we can find a field down here that is uh, that we'll be able to add to our page. So we can click on post summary and you can see here that we've got our uh, a bit of content here that is coming up in our title and in, in, as our meta description. But this here is a bit long, so you can see here that it's got an ellipse. So I'm just going to show you how we can add a title tag that is the right length. So if we go up here and save, and we go to our CMS settings, click on uh, the settings here for our, our blog post. We're going to add a field and we're going to call it meta description. And we're going to add in um, maximum 160 characters. And we're going to save that. We're going to save the collection. And then we're going to go here to the blog that we're working on. And we're just going to post in the content here. Now you can see here that we've gone over the 160 characters. So uh, what I can do is just, we can easily just delete this and we're down into the right number of characters and this meta description seems good. And we're going to just save this draft. And if we go back to our page settings under CMS collection, click the anchor, come down here and we're going to change this post summary and we're going to add in our meta description and you can see here now we're in the tag uh, that if we save this we're in the wrong page at the moment but I'm going to just change this now to our draft page and we're going to go back to here and you can see oh, we're still in what is a title tag so the way we fix this is we go back into our CMS item and you can see down here that we actually don't have a meta description for this particular blog so I'm just going to copy this and paste it in and we're going to save exit and then we're going to go back to our page settings and then you can see that the meta description page is now showing and if we click to the next page the content here is all dynamic. So we've got dynamic title tags and dynamic meta descriptions.